Hey there, PFC Irish Goofy here. Welcome back to my channel. It's time for Furry Friday. It's in the week, so it's time to have some fun with some. Let's see what the furries have been going, doing, been up to. <laughs> yeah, I know I kind of tongue tied and stumble over myself, but hey, that's part of the fun of my videos. So let's get into this and see what the furries have been doing. At least two or three episodes, we had some had something similar to this. It was just the drawing of it. This is the actual fur suit. This person, this person is ready to do dungeon and go play Dungeon and Dragons right here, or go to the Renaissance Fair. <laughs> oh, I can only imagine how the people who work at the Renaissance Fair will have to react to this. <laughs> oh man, that it would be, that would be fun to watch. <laughs> Man, it, dude, if this is, dude, if you're watching this video, and you got this fur suit, wear it to the Renaissance Fair, I, I, and have a, a friend with you record the reaction that the workers give to the you in that costume, because and you, to you in that fur suit, because that that will that would be fantastic. Uh, I will, and then post that on YouTube, and you'll get ton, you'll probably get a ton of views, or post it on the uh, Facebook furry subreddit. The furry group and put post on the group of the r slash furry, which this is off of. <laughs> oh man! Now this one has a great message. Ooh, how'd you get so good at drawing? And the little guy says, "I didn't give up." Well, me, uh, <laughs> the way I get good at drawing is tracing because that's the best I can do. I cannot, I can't draw to save my life. And I'm sorry if there's a lot of pops going on and su stuff sharp like that. I don't have a mic right now. I will be when I'm done traveling, but right now I have to. I'm using a gaming headset. Uh, <laughs> but uh, and see, I, I don't give up making these videos. I keep making them. I'll get dislikes. I won't get. Well, I've only got one video that got a bunch of dislikes. I don't really get dislikes on any of my other videos <laughs> because, like, like furry fry, like this. I try to make this an accepting one with with good humor jokes. So. <laughs> Oh, just some good humor down in the uh, down in the comments below. I would really like to to get some good humor, and even if it's about post here, even if it's not about post here, just put it down in the comments and let's get some good humor going on. <laughs> okay, I know you're supposed to be able to see all those eyes, but <laughs> you could have <laughs> gone something that's not so blank. Uh, you can still get where it has an actual eyeball, and you can actually see out of it because that is a little dis off-putting right there. I know what you're going for to be friendly, but that kind of looks a little more possessed and friendly. My friend's mom knitted telephone a knitted telephone scarf and she wore it. God bless this amazing d duchess? Duchy? Uh, I, I don't know what you're going for there, but <laughs> that is nice that a friend's mom made that scar. I that is very nice of her to do. And if you hear something in the background, it's the wind where I'm at. I'm at that windows and doors open where I'm at, or I'm gonna get way too hot. <laughs> but yeah, it's very it's very nice. Uh, yeah, so moving on. <laughs> We all know what this is like. If you've ever been sunburned, or you've ever played sports, there's a time of year where we just start peeling. It's unavoidable. <laughs> I remember uh, going through boot camp when I when I had this going on. It was on my hands. It was on my feet. They thought they actually thought I was had some sort of athlete's foot thing. They sent me to go get checked out. Came back clean. <laughs> oh man! And when the skin, and you can see see this. It, when the skin won't come off, you you just keep pulling, trying to get it off. <laughs> We've all gone through stuff like this before. I don't care who you are. You've gone through some type of pillin, especially if you're Caucasian. If you're white, you've gone through pillin because we get sunburned so freaking easy. I know I do. My uh, fiance does as well. <laughs> she gets sunburned quicker than I do. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Aww, you're a beast. 
and more. <laughs> and, oh look, it's Utopia, Officer Hobbs, and I forget the fox's name, but this is what this is. This is what remind it reminds me of. <laughs> oh man. Uh, I do, I do find this funny. <laughs> oh, man, that works in more than one way. <laughs> That's my unfriendly family moment right there, saying that. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, is this particular fursona very popular among furries? Because whether you see them in TV shows, when you think of furries and stuff like that, you see stuff like this. Is this character, uh, this, uh, Fursona, uh, popular or something? Because when you think of furs, you, this is what you think of. Uh, uh, the suits that look like this guy. Is that is that a thing with the furs? Is this uh, popular? If I'm her sorry if you hear any beeping in the background. I can't help it. Uh, but is this guy popular in, in the first, in the furry community? I want I, I do want to know. Tell me in the comments below. Dang. When I see this, I kind of hope that's supposed to be a uh, female for Surrey, because when I see this, the the song "I Like Big Butts and I Cannot Lie" starts going in my head. <laughs> if it's a guy, I'm I don't know why it's going in my head, but they are short shorts, so it, it most likely is a female persona, most likely. But <laughs> that's the song that plays in my head. <laughs> Oh, what song plays in your head when you when uh, what's some songs when you see uh, people's fursonas? What are songs that pl start playing in your head automatically? I, I, it'd be interesting to find out. <laughs> and what are the fursonas when you see them that make the song play in your head? That would be nice to know. <laughs> Except for the smiling, this almost reminds me of uh, one of Evie's evolutions, the dark one, if it had some blue highlights, which would be nice, actually. <laughs> oh, man. First time painting in over eight months. You did a very good job, my friend. You did a very good job. I know I haven't said this enough this video, but to all you artists out there who are making these, you're doing a great job. You're doing a very great job. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not gonna individually call out the the artist and a lot of the personas don't even have the artist tag on it. But if you recognize this as yours, you've done a very good job. Uh, if you recognize any of your artwork in my in my uh, Furry Friday videos, go down, put your information down so people can get a hold of you. Go down in my comments, put your information in so people can get a hold of you so they can get their so they can get the artwork done if 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 you're willing to do stuff like that. I mean, I'm a, uh, I'm waiting for fan artwork to start hitting my subreddit, r slash Irish Goofy. Just by my name alone, I'm I do uh, I can ex uh, I'm just waiting for that one person who to find my <laughs> videos, go to my subreddit and drop fan art in it. I mean, you got Irish, you've got PFC, and you have Goofy. You can go crazy with it. <laughs> Uh, moving on. Also, a quick reminder: any uh, fan art that's submitted to my subreddit, I will feature in my videos. Uh, mainly here on the, mainly on the Furry Fridays, but I will feature it throughout the other videos if they have anything to do with the other videos as well. Okay, this is almost this is almost Halloweenish. <laughs> oh man, it is a wi wizard lizard, <laughs> or is it a Dino Wizard? Oh, um, I'm not sure exactly, but that is awesome. <laughs> the wizard turned themselves into a furry. <laughs> oh, man, that's funny. <laughs> God save the queen. Okay, this this is what cats truly think of themselves, and how some people see their cats. As royalty. Yes, cats think themselves very high <laughs> above the, everybody. I can just imagine uh, someone's fursona. Walking around acting like they're high and mighty above all because their persona is a cat. <laughs> man. Oh, man. Oh, I, I, the fact that I can imagine that. I can imagine some of these snobby people I've ran into in real life going to these furry conventions dressed as cats because they think themselves higher than everybody else. Oh, man. 
<laughs> oh man, Did someone actually animated this. This is funny. The monk says, ooh woo. Then the sign says, drawing legs is hard. Change my mind. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I love these change my mind memes. I mean, they do it for everything. Uh, uh, Star Wars, I'm waiting for the Star Wars ones to start popping up for it. But... I do agree, uh, I, I, drawing is hard period for me, because I'm not an art, I, I have no artistic ability, uh, yeah, <laughs> me, I would have trouble drawing that, I draw, the intricate detail they did is amazing though, I'd have a hard time drawing the hands, the mug, the face, the tail, the whole thing. <laughs> because I don't have the patience or the artist's ability to do drawings like that. My art form lies in making these videos, congratulating other artists, and taking pictures. Yes, my main art, I took a I did a whole slew of photography classes in college, so <laughs> yeah. I may include some of those pictures on another subreddit I might cover eventually, but for right now, this, this I'm not n n not featuring any of my artwork. <laughs> not until I figure out how to do a watermark on them, because I know some of the artwork some people might try to take, and I have had people try to take my pictures and claim it as their own. <laughs> they got kicked out of college for that. <laughs> Is it just me, or do most people prefer dog personas because that's what it seems like <laughs> uh, I'm not saying this is a dog but it does seem like more people go with the dog personas than any of the others I think this is a dog I'm pretty sure it is I'm not sure what type of dog it would be but it's a for it's one heck of a persona I can tell you that and to this artist great job once again <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna thank all the artists again at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. I'm not gonna list them off, but I'm gonna give a big thank you to them. <laughs> oh man. Aww, poor puppy. It looks like he was stood up or something, I'm not sure. But I hate to see uh, any type of dog cry. I mean, I'd treat my dog basically like a. Like like everybody should treat their animal as part of the family. You treat your first. I'm sure you all treat y'all's persona as part of the fa as part of yourself, as you should. And everybody should treat their pets as part of their family. So these people who go and dump their their dogs and cats in the middle of nowhere, how freaking rude are you? Uh, if you see someone cat uh, dumping their dogs, their animals in the middle of nowhere. Please take a picture of their license plate and turn them into the proper authorities. This way they can be fined for their stupidity of dumping their pets in the middle of nowhere instead of doing like they're supposed to and take them to a pound, take them to a shelter of sorts, take them to a veterinarian's office and say they don't want their pet anymore. Most vet veterinarian offices will take your pet and they'll get it to the proper, get it to the proper home. Or they'll find a home for it. Or you can list your pet on freaking Craigslist, like most, like a, like a civilized person. But don't, don't leave your pup, don't leave your animals out like this. I know it's, it's a persona. It's not, a, it's not uh, one of our four-legged friends. It's a two-legged friend. But still, I have to, I have to say that. Okay, quick question: Why is the red right in the middle of the torso? I don't understand that. And then. Uh, uh, I don't know what you were going for here. I do appreciate that you did put put this on uh, up. It's, it is very well drawn. It looks like it could use a little more coloration <laughs> and some context, please. I really, I need, really need some context of why this is this. <sighs> I'm sorry if you hear any type of engine in the background. They're doing there's some yard work going on outside. I do like this. This is looks like someone who's dressed to go to work almost. He's got like a button-up shirt underneath and a, a nice little uh, sweater over the top. It looks like he's ready to go to work. Very nicely done too. Yes, I think we all feel like this on a Monday. We don't feel like that today because today's Friday. <laughs> but yes, Monday's without coffee. Yeah, Monday's with coffee. For those who like coffee, yeah. 
Me, I have to get up on weekdays. I have to get up at five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> no coffee. I don't drink. I don't actually like the taste of coffee, so I don't drink it. Uh, if I did, I'd probably be a lot more energetic if I did. But <laughs> I don't drink coffee. I don't. I don't. I'm an odd person. I don't really drink caffeine that much. But I love my sugar. <laughs> Give me a chocolate bar any day of the week. I'll take that over a cup of coffee. Although I will do five hour energy occasionally, but it's only if I've got to be up for 24 hours, say, say like 24 hours. If I get to be that long, I'm taking <laughs> 25, 24 hour energy, 25 hour energy, 24 hour energy. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> There's nothing quite like sitting back and watching some TV. This dude has got it right. Oh, love the glasses touch. That's a great. If this is your first dude, awesome job. Be a little comfortable with that candle over there, but other than that, awesome job. Dude, is this your room or hotel room? Seriously. That that is that is some nice carpet you got on the floor there. This is probably your house, but. But you can, you can understand, you can... I think this is the same bay frame that my uh, aunt has that was my mom's from over 20, 30, 7, 30, she was 12, 40, yeah, about 40, 42 years ago. <laughs> oh man, it's nice if that's, if that's that old or they started remaking it again. <laughs> but... Nice room, nice fursuit. <laughs> and with that, we're gonna end the video there. Uh, I like when I do this subreddit because uh, the people who tend to uh, subscribe to my channel, they don't mind me poking some light fun at stuff. It's all in good humor. Freaking Jets! God! Jets! Every time I try to record in the evening for the next day. Freaking Jets! Well, all that being said, please like. Ooh, they get close again. Okay, like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. I am giving away a twenty-five dollar Amazon gift card when I reach uh, one thousand subscribers. So quick, more, uh, and I've got, I've had some a couple days where I've gotten some growth, some actual good growth, uh, not double-digit growth, unfortunately, but uh, growth nevertheless. Any new subscriber is a good growth for my channel. Now all that being said, I hope you all enjoy you all have a, the rest of your f have a fantastic rest of your fantastic furry Fridays, Friday. And come back tomorrow to catch my uh so what am I doing tomorrow? Tomorrow is my Star Wars Saturday. And Sunday's going to be a random choice. I'm yeah, Sunday's a random choice, but I have been doing Eric the one that day, so I might keep doing that until the raid. And uh, definitely tune in for my anti MLM Mondays. Fantastic show! If you know people who uh, don't, who have had difficulties with MLMs in the past, either they've been offered to join or they actually did join, have them have them come to my channel. Watch that and. Uh, Talk him, try to talk him to subscribing because I want to get rid of that $25 Amazon gift card. <laughs> uh, I'm not saying a thousand comments, I'm saying just a thousand subscribers. Because when I reach a thousand, I'm one, that's one step closer to being monetized. The, what's going to take the longest is getting the views. And I'm ending this before that jet gets any closer. Freaking jet gets too damn close. Well, as I say at the end of all my videos, stay safe. My friends.